Hello, I'm Helen from The Pen and I. This is my story for Festival Fables at the Nairn Book and Arts Festival. Scat the cat. This kitten does not have a home. So she set out to wander and roam. This kitten is greeted with scat from a big ginger neighbourhood cat. A sleeping Tom opens one eye, wondering what he might spy in his alley, of which he's the boss. An intruder, he thinks, and is cross. The lazy Tom growls at the stranger, who now knows for sure she's in danger. At this sound, there appears from nowhere a pussy with white fluffy hair. She is cute and she knows that she's pretty. She's the loveliest cat in the city. She stares at the kitten and jeers. Scat, what are you doing round here? Our kitten has now had enough. And she runs from this cute ball of fluff. She spotted a flap in the door. She carefully puts through a paw. She can't even enter the room. A shout of scat cat and a broom send her bottom first into the yard. She is finding her homeless life hard. She thinks, have I got a name? We cats can't all be called the same. At that thought, she hears the word scat and thinks, my name must be that. From a boy who's playing football and is worried that he'll miss the goal. Scat takes a big tumble and fall and runs straight into a brick wall. With her head in a spin, she rushes and hides in her fright in some bushes. When Scat wakes, she is warm, she is snug and is lying on a fireside rug with a dish of fresh water to drink and a big bowl of warm cullen skink. Fully fed and content, she soon sees a pair of blanketed knees. With a soft lap attached to these knees, Scat thinks, I can jump up with ease. Which she does, and she lands on her paws, and carefully retracts her claws, so as not to scratch the man's lap and wake him from his afternoon nap. A gentle hand on her back reassures, and brings on the loudest of purrs. A soft voice says, will you please stay? and keep me happy all day. You can have the run of my house if you'll catch the occasional mouse. Scat meows, yes, I will if you please, and I promise I'll never get fleas or make a mess in your home if it means I no longer must roam. And my name, by the way, is Scat. Now that's a good name for a cat. And my name is Ted, said his friend. Now our story will have a great end. I hope you've enjoyed my story. Tune in again, same time tomorrow.